I'm here. I'm here at Grady's in the fishing department. I want to talk to you a little bit about the colors that I use in my soft plastics. That's one of the most discussed topics is how do I, how do I pick out what color of soft plastic I want to use? Do I need to use dark? Do I need to use light? Do I need to use shad patterns? All of those color situations are based on a couple of different things. I base it on the weather. Is it sunny? Is it cloudy? Is it windy? Water clarity? And what am I trying to mimic? Or am I trying to mimic brim, crawdads, shad? What am I trying to mimic? And I'll give you a brief description of three of my favorite colors and the baits that I use when I'm using these specific colors. Anytime I'm throwing a shad bait, a fluke type bait, a swim bait, it's really simple. I'll just keep it in the shad patterns. A pearl, anything like this. This is disco shad. Pearls always work no matter what color the water clarity is when you're using minnow type baits. If I'm flipping a creature bait, flipping lay downs, flipping docks, and I'm using a craw or a creature bait, I always stick to black, blues, or blacks with red. That's always works. Doesn't matter what the, what the water clarity is, that's always a good color to use. If I'm in really extremely clear water and I'm using a finesse presentation with soft plastic worms, finesse baits, the best go-to color is green pumpkin. Green pumpkin works every water clarity. It doesn't matter if it's stained, it doesn't matter if it's clear, green pumpkin always works. So stick to those three colors with those three baits and I think you'll be really satisfied with your results.